welcome, welcome. This is Technique Tuesday, Ask Coach Vic. I'm your lovely host, Coach Vic, and this is brought to you by the DB Lab and our lovely partners, Playmaker Media. The DB Lab is America's football number one defensive back development program. We train athletes on all levels, all walks of life. We currently have some of the top guys in the country right now, and we're so grateful for that as well. Um, so today we're gonna go over, uh, we have Chalk Talk today in our playbook. All right, and so uh, it's gonna be a little different. It's a little different from what you guys are used to seeing, uh, but we want chalk talk, okay? We're gonna go over uh, filling the alley from the free safety position, okay? Uh, it's it's been so often. Well, this is so often I get to uh, you know, of course, be there at football games, high school and college, in a lot of terms where um, the defensive backs are not taking the proper uh, steps to need to take. Re-step, shuffle, shuffle, get to the alley now. They're missing all those details. And so we're gonna go over that with you guys today and I'm so excited about that, all right? So you guys stay tuned, stay locked. I'll be right back right after this. <laughs> Sometimes I see um, high schoolers are not being taught the proper way to get to their alley, right? Usually what they do is they'll see a ball and they just run to the ball. That's not necessarily the way you do that, okay? Especially on angles, all right? You don't necessarily want to do that on angles. You want to make sure you're taking the right proper steps, read steps, shovel steps to get to your alley. You can't just run around because if you don't and the ball goes the other way, you're asked out. Okay, so that's what we're going over right now. All right, so here we go. So we kind of go on a little basic, it's a basic run, all right? We're in a basic offense pro set, okay? Basic, all right? We got the QB, we got the fullback and the running back. Running back getting the ball is on the left side. I don't know what you want to call it, a strong side pitch, whatever, you know what I'm saying? We got a tight end over here so we know the strong side, all right? So, um, and we got the X right here, okay? So we're gonna kind of show everybody's, uh, from the defensive back standpoint, everybody's positioning. Um, as far as the front seven, I'll just uh, put them in place. Uh, but what we really wanna focus on is the safeties right here, and a little bit of the corners too, and see what the corners are doing, all right? So here we go. The ball is gonna come, uh, the ball is going to the uh, left side right here. So here we go. So let's, uh, so his job is to make sure that this thing doesn't stretch out. So he's gonna feel, bam. He's gonna feel, he's gonna take on his block from this tight end right here. All right, his tight end is gonna have to try, to try to reach him, okay? Then he's gonna go here, bam. That's his goal, get up in that hole right here. He's gonna go here, he's gonna go here. Yeah, and then he's gonna go, he's gonna go in here somewhere. Forget that, right? He's just gonna make sure that it doesn't backtrack so he can't overplay it, basically. It's the, the D on the, on the opposite side. All right, his thing is gonna be uh, shuffle, shuffle, here, shuffle, shuffle, here, okay? Now that's basic stuff, right? So that's neither here nor there. Actually, I'll just let him stay right here, okay? This is the other D in, okay? All right, but he has to, his responsibility is gonna make sure uh, nothing comes back, okay? So you gotta cut him, you gotta hit more like this. All right, yeah, that's his responsibility. Make sure that it come, comes back to the other side. All right, so now we're talking about DBs. This, this, this is where I'm here for, okay? We're talking about the DBs. All right, so as a, as a strong safety and the ball is going to the opposite side of you, you have to make sure that you get the proper re-step and, and the proper shuffles, okay? So it's gonna be re-step, it's gonna be re-step, shuffle, shuffle, Right? And it's gonna be feel. Okay? This guy right here is gonna be re-step, shuffle, feel. He had to do two or three shuffles. He had one shuffle. Okay? Alright? And he's gonna go with the flow. Maybe not run that far over. It just depends on what the play looking like. Alright, but it looks like they committed to it. But even more so in here, okay? All right, so he'll, he'll be replacing this guy. He'll be replacing the, um, the Will Batman, all right? So he's, he's gonna be right here. So, for the corners, this corner, he's gonna slow play. 
He's gonna slow play, okay? He's gonna make sure this guy, this running back doesn't come back or they do another trick play or something like that. These guys have to make sure they in line, in lock tune, lock step with each other, okay? All right, this corner right here, he's gonna, um, he's gonna make sure he protects his outside, all right? It's him the sideline, protect his outside. He want to, that, that receiver's gonna try to block him, his job is to take us outside. What's gonna happen is gonna be a beautiful alley open for this free safety. He's gonna be shuffle, shuffle, or he's gonna be shuffle and go, right? He's gonna be shuffle, shuffle, and go, all right? At the free safety position, the strong safety position, okay? So uh, uh, this is very basic, but really what I'm trying to get you to understand is the shuffle, shuffle principle, the re-step and the shuffle, step principle. It's gonna be here. It's re-step, shuffle, 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 go, or, Re-step, shuffle, shuffle, go, all right? Why do you need to shuffle? Good question. So the reason why we shuffle is because we need, to, we need it, it allows us time to see the play. So if we didn't shuffle, let's say we just ran down, bam, right? That was great, right, it's cool. But what happens if this fullback goes out for a play or something like that? We can't see that happen. Could we even put the shuffles in there? Real small, but great details that we need to have. You gotta be able to see what happens. So if you get the shuffle in there, the shuffle, shuffle in there, then you can see what's going on, and then you can commit, commit to your alley. But when you commit, you gotta go right now. You know what I'm saying? But you gotta go under control. You have to go under control, but you gotta go right now. So that's the deal there. That's the reason why we shuffle, okay? Uh, because it can be a fake play for sure. It could do. They can definitely do that. But it's kind of very basic, right? Very, very basic. Um, um, there's no real true concept behind it besides I just want to show you the shuffle shuffle concept of the strong safety and free safety. Uh, and, then, and, then the, and then show you the principles of the uh, cornerback and the, uh, the, the backside corner uh, and then the, um, the near side corner. And the crazy part about this is when, when you have free safety and you watch this alley opens up, man, it's like a beautiful thing. And the reason why is because you see, you, you, at free safety, especially when I played in college in the Nice, you had to know everything, right? And so you know what everybody was doing. You know what the what the chessboard had to do to get to that point. And it makes it a beautiful thing, a beautiful piece of artwork to see the alley open up. Because when you start off, you know, all your uh, when you start off with your re-step, you start with your shuffle, shuffle. When you first start off getting getting ready to get into your alley, the alley may not be there. But then it opens up as soon as you come under control. And if you do your job, you make the tackle, it's done deal. So it's a, uh, it's a good deal, man. It's beautiful, beautiful artwork. Uh, that's the reason why I love it. That's the reason why I love defensive back position as well. So, um, but yeah, so these are kind of the, the, the core basic principles. Um, like I said before, uh, domestically, yes, a lot of you guys kind of know this already. Internationally, these are my international fans out there who want to know a little more about the, uh, the skill of position, uh, free safety, and strong safety. So, this in corner. So, these for you guys. You guys need to know that out there, right? My guys in Brazil, my guys in Germany, all right? China that's playing football out there, all right? Uh, I think it's Kuwait um, that's playing um, the West Indians. So, all those. So, that's it for right there. So, that's it. That's the artwork. For those who love this artwork, you'll like it. So, that's the deal right there.